Joining us to help discuss Michelle's will uh, is attorney William B. Dawson. He is a fellow of, in the American College of Trial Lawyers and in the International Academy of Trial Lawyers, two of the most elite groups uh, of practitioners uh, in the world. He has been practicing law for 40 years and has taken a good long look at this will. Uh, so, Mr. Dawson, welcome to the show. Thank you. Um, is, is this an unusual document? It is. You said earlier, where there's a will, there's a way. Really, the first issue is, is there a will? There are no formalities. It's not signed. It's not witnessed. It's not notarized. And then there's the issue of, if it is a will, whose will is it? And now, if it is a will, and it's Michelle's, and there is an executor, even though the executor didn't exist then, is it null and void? Because if Ryan shows hands of greed, I don't know if he needs to show both or one, but if he does that, <laughs> it becomes null and void, and then the property would pass intestate, which probably would be the daughter who's acknowledged in the will. So there are lots of, there are a lot of issues associated with this particular document. Okay, well, first off, it says this is the last will and testament of Michelle S., and that's you. Yes. Whether it was her intention or not, this document is drawn as your will because Michelle S. is you. Right, but she was also under so much medication. Well, but you understand, oh, understand this that. is the will of Michelle S. She's Michelle J. I understand that. Or M. Does Michelle Jacqueline have a will here? Don't see one. And it names the executor. Suzanne Elizabeth doesn't exist. She named an executor that doesn't exist. But she knew that's what her and I both discussed what my name was going to be. I'm sorry? We both discussed what we were I was going to change my name to be. I've got a copy of your petition to change your name to Susan Elizabeth dated in November, five months after she passed. Mm -hmm. So you didn't file it in March, you filed it in November. I was starting to file it. Well, you filed it in November. I understand, I understand that. Yes, I understand that. I've been busy too, but that's not an excuse. Well, it's not, it's not a matter of an excuse or not. It's a matter of that person didn't even exist and still doesn't exist at the time this will was drawn. 